about being stuck out here, I will not apologize for bringing you on this trip. Do you have any idea how long I've been waiting to share something like this with you? To have a moment alone to reconnect, to breathe in nature, to breathe in each other and know that we are enough and I'm enough. They know enough to know that I don't have to feel alone all the time. I hope you know that too. Do you remember when I used to tell you about my survival training? Oh yeah, I know, I know. You don't like it when I talk about my old war stories. But when we were out there, they told us about this rule of three. Have you ever heard of it? It's a little fuzzy, but it goes something like, the average person can survive three weeks without food, three days without water, and three minutes without air. After I let that sink in, my first thought was, what about people? How long can we go without human interaction? Without feeling the warmth of a hug? How long can we go without and really survive? <laughs> Going it alone before succumbing to the lack of food, or water, air. The thing that dies last, just before the final beat of our heart, is hope. And I know the way this trip is going isn't ideal, but we'll survive. I know that because, at least I think I know I have you. We're not alone. We have each other. We have time. And we have hope. Uh -huh.